feel upset, they can come in here and kind of chill out. We got blankets and soft stuff. We got stress stuff. We got aromatherapy in his right here. Okay. Um, we got a nice little fountain and mm -hmm. kind of just chill out. Okay. And this is the this is this location is titled. Oh, it's called the uh, Cleveland Rib Crisis Center Human Trafficking Drop-In Center. Okay. So, um, All right. then we're part of Cleveland Rib Crisis. Well, I am. Uh, we, we, this is Cleveland Rib Crisis <laughs> okay. Center. Right. So, in here is a shower. This is a handicapped shower. So, we had, um, we made sure we got a shower chair in there just in case in individuals need extra support but we kept all the the decorum and throughout the center gender neutral because we um support lgbtq um, communities as well as males um you know men and boys are because they you know they're traffic as well okay, we have right. affirmations throughout the building right okay to make sure that um, individuals feel safe um, okay here's our other shower here sort of the same set up okay we have a handicapped bathroom in here as well as we also have a changing table because we want to you know we understand our guests may have little ones with them so mm. we want to make sure that you know things they feel okay that they can go right <laughs> gotcha. we have another restroom here okay is, when the light comes on okay, you walk absolutely. in right so okay. we offer uh, laundry as well so we have a washer and dryer because again guests do are maybe coming from the shelter okay and they need to wash a uh, load of laundry they can do it free of charge we offer um laundry detergent um mm -hmm. what's that uh allergy free red okay. laundry detergent um and our entire center is uh funded by grants and private donations so okay. we make donations for our laundry detergent so throughout here, we consider this a space for the guests. So we offer snacks, um, okay. coffee. We make popcorn early. We got a popcorn machine. Okay. Um, we have uh, again, we get donations. So we got snacks in here, um, light snacks. Okay. And we're always willing to take more snacks if anybody you know anybody who can you know offer this. Right. We, we have Netflix on this TV. So if guests want to kind of chill out, mm -hmm. they can listen to music or they can turn on a movie and just kind of chill out eating a bag of popcorn. <laughs> okay. Now they can't stay here overnight, can they? Not overnight. Okay. But we are here 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. Monday through Friday. And they can come in in crisis if they... Get, they happen to get away from the person. Absolutely. They come straight here. Absolutely. Okay. We offer computers here for work to, workforce development. So if anyone's interested in learning, you know, maybe they're taking a class online or maybe they're doing, you know, resume mm -hmm. building. We have advocates available who can um, offer that to them. Okay. So I don't know if you want to take. Oh no! I, I, okay. I, I, I was like, I don't know. If oh, how take you doing? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Cause this would be on. This would be on. You know. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> how you doing? Another All right. How you doing? Our yeah. Third advocate's out right now. Okay. So we can actually. Okay. We can end it. No, no, no. Oh, we, there's still more to see, huh? Sure. Great. Sure. Okay. We have a donation room. Oh, okay. So uh, again, um, you know, we accept. You accept you know, donations, okay? Yeah, it have to be new for clothing items and shoes. Brand okay, new, right. Any, well, everything. Right. We don't want to give you stuff. Yeah, so. yeah, right, right, right. Okay. So we offer, we have three offices. So for community partners who mm -hmm. may do programming, they are welcome to come and use our office space if they got to take a call or take a meeting. Mm -hmm. um, I'm generally in here, but if somebody needed to come out, mm -hmm. you know, if they needed to... You know, come in here. They can definitely come in and okay. do that. Um, and then finally, we got two group rooms. So we partner with uh, several organizations like Case Western Reserve Law Clinic, um, Belfair, you know, um, Providence House, okay. and providers come in and do programming for. Uh, our guests, so we can move these tables any kind of way they want to. If they want okay. to set it up like a classroom, okay. we have Wi-Fi in here if you want to do like a video or do something like that. So we okay. offer whatever we can. <laughs> if we don't have it, we're gonna go look for it. Right. To make Absolutely. Sure people have it. Absolutely. So this room is kind of like that. Room. And how long have you been here at this site? We've been. We open March first. Okay. They're doing the training. Yeah, they're doing the training. Um, so we open March first. Um, we took our first guests shortly after that, which okay. we were excited. So we're referring to survivors as guests because we want them to feel welcome and not feel like a, right. a victim or a survivor right. or a client or anything like that. So we right. call them guests. Okay. Yep. And this is the Human Trafficking 
Cleveland Rape Crisis Center. Okay.